Hey guys, I'm Paper Sack. Welcome back to the Adventures of Bertram Fiddle. Last time we left off, we were in search of Floofy, so let's go see if she knows where he went. Have you found out anything yet? I'm still conducting my investigation. Well, tell me as soon as you're hmm. done. Our readers demand news as soon as it happens. Okay. Uh, let's see. We can go this way or we can go inside here. I think I'm gonna go in here first. Hmm. Oh, is this a bar? What a glorious rhinoceros! <laughs> rhinoceros. <laughs> What's this? Ugh. He looks a bit sickly. Yeah, he does. He looks dead. What a unique horn. What sort of animal is it? It's a unicorn. A genuine Fijian mermaid. Although it does look a bit fishy. Oh, this game and its puns. The main attraction. Taking pride of place on the wall. <laughs> How can you not laugh at that? What an imposing pachyderm. His trunk is colossal. How about this? That poor creature has not been mounted properly. It looks like it could fall down any minute. Okay, well that's going to be useful to know. His antlers are as twisted as this mystery. Your Majesty. Okay, that's the Queen. Hmm. Has someone been trolling? Okay, now let's go back and talk to these guys over here and see if they know anything. I think there was a... Uh, no, okay. Let's talk to Bartender. Oh, good evening, Mr. Fiddles. The usual. Yes, please. One can never have enough tea. <laughs> okay, so I got a cup of tea. Let's talk to this guy in a wheelchair. How do you do, Sir Grouchly? How do you think, Fiddle? Things haven't been the same since I lost my legs in Venice. How do you lose your legs Constant in Venice? Constant pain, Fiddle. Constant. Oh, I am How do you sorry. Lose your legs in Venice? That sounds terrible. You weren't there, man. You weren't there. <laughs> What's this? Oh, porcupine canopies. A prickly aperitif. Okay. Got one of those, too. How are you? Guy Hardwood, how are you? Fiddle. Long time no see. Yes, it's been a while. Oh, yes. Just telling Melvis here about my latest adventure. Four months in Patagonia. In South America. Quite discovered a lost world. It was well splendid. Yeah. Found this thing up a crevice. Crevasse. Crevasse. So I thought I'd bring it back. Don't even know what it what is. is. Can I see it? Not a few ideas. Oh, that thing. Crazy. Is it a dodo bird? Historic. Let's look at it. It's a very unique looking creature. That it is. Don't touch fiddle. She bites. Not too keen on being cooped up. I wonder why not. Elbow off. But if she got out. Who knows what she might do? Pandemonium, I expect. Okay. Is the lock safe? Safe as houses, Fiddle. Paid top shilling for that beauty. Ah, okay. So that's a strong lock. What about this guy? The sick guy. Lord Rochester has been asleep since 1882. A grisly and gnarled member. Dag. He's been asleep for a while. What about Grumpy Pants over here in front of the door? I'm afraid, Mr. Fiddle, you are not permitted into the gold members area. It is for A-list adventurers only. Am I not? I've never been so outraged. I need to see Sherlock Holmes. Mr. Holmes has asked expressly not to be disturbed as he is working on the dreadful case of Jeff the Murderer. I have my own case I want to talk to him about. I'm afraid, Mr. Fiddle, you are not permitted into the gold members area. Well, this is bull crap. Come on, Gavin. Let's leave. Actually, we're getting in. We're doing... We are definitely getting in. Time to cause a flight. That's right. <laughs> fly, little creature. Fly. Yeah. Break it. it all. You buffoon! What have you done? Ah, there we go. I'm blocked. Come back! Come back! Now run through the door. There we go. That's how you get in. Ooh. Oh yes, that's the spot. Mm. Lord Cragglewedge, 
first man to climb halfway up Mount Everest. Quite an achievement. Climb halfway up. Sir Clive Odwing, the world-renowned ornithologist's <laughs> private chamber. He left his... He's left his door ajar. Okay. Can we enter? Yes, we can. Do you mind? Oh, uh, terribly sorry. What are you doing? The door was open and I... Uh, never... Uh, hmm. uh, no. Ooh, yeah. down a bit, Sandra. Door just stand there gawking, man. I'm sure it's nothing I've seen before. Actually, it is. Ooh. Uh, <laughs> ooh. Careful, huh? Okay, so is there anything else? Is that the breasted wedgecock? Why? I've not seen one of those for many a year. About this. Pick those leaves up from a fellow in Indies. Strong stuff. Good for relaxing. Help yourself. Okay, so I got one of those. Um, I'll be off then. Be a good fellow and shut the door on your way out. Okay. Yeah, let's leave. Uh, I don't need to see any of this. Let's, let's leave. I think that's what I was supposed to come in there for anyway. Uh, is this a griffin? Hmm, yes. The infamous Jade Griffin. Yeah. Okay, now let's see if Mr. Holmes ah, is in. Sherlock's private room. No doubt where he works on his important cases. That's right. Now let's go in there. Ha! I win again, Watson. <laughs> you really are a dolt. I'm sorry, Holmes. I'm trying. Earlier. It's just I don't really understand the rules of this game. Or your games. Okay. Let's talk to him. Ah, oh, fiddle. Ah, oh, fiddle. What brings you here? Come to bore us with more tales of one of your piffling adventures, have you? No. I'm on a mission to return this bag unto its rightful owner. And who is its rightful owner? That I have yet to ascertain. There are absolutely no clues whatsoever. Have you tried looking in the bag? No. Ah, I never thought of that. Okay, let's look inside the bag, see what's in there. Oh, a head. The features have been sliced off expertly with a sharp instrument by someone with skill and panache. Aha, <laughs> this looks like the work of London's most elusive serial killer. Jeff the murderer. Ha! Good luck finding Does him. Does he have my floofy? The whole of Scotland Yard hasn't been able to track him down in decades. I rather fancy my luck, Holmes. He can't be that far away. And he's got my floofy. Did you fiddle. You couldn't find your own tolly water in the toilet. <laughs> I'll wager you That's wager funny. you don't even come close. <laughs> wager me then. If you come on. Find Jeff the Speak murderer, with the money. I'll wear a woman's dress and dance the trifling gallop round the streets of Lambeth. I accept, good sir. Nice to see you, Bertram. Shush, Watson. But this... Hmm. Does the nose fit? That's not to be sniffed at. Okay. Can I, can I check anywhere else? Huh. There's gotta be something else. I say. I say. <laughs> I hope she doesn't have bad breath. Okay. I uh. That's not to be sniffed at. Okay, so am I not supposed to do that? Go away, Phil. I'm, I'm trying but to. The, shush, what? But the Maybe I could... Ma okay. Oh. oh, crap. Does this go here somewhere? Okay. Uh, can I give this to him? Try this one. It's a special blend. Yeah, I can. Give me that. Being the world's greatest crook thwarter is thirsty work. Okay. What 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 is in this tea? I feel somewhat strange. We drugged him. What have you done? Is he dead? Don't worry, Watson. He's just sleeping. Oh, good. Uh, I mean, good. Now, was there something you wanted to tell me? Yeah. I know you'll think me silly for saying, but you need to ask the spirits for help. Spirits? Okay. I am a man of science. I don't believe in such puffery. No, Bertram. They exist. I have seen them with my own two eyes. 
Sherlock says it was a seagull. But I know it was the spirit of the recently departed. Okay, where do we where do we go to see sometimes this? Sometimes on in this realm, especially if it has been wronged. You should help her find peace by collecting the missing body parts. Try and find Count Fulchmuckle. He's a gentleman with an acquired taste, but he does have certain connections. I'm sure he can help you on your quest. Okay. There was a book I could look, I could click on back here earlier. Okay, get. Okay, no, I can't. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Been there, been there, been there, been. Th oh, that's new. Okay. Uh, let's go find whatever his name was. Are we going to get into trouble when we walk out here? Oh no, we can st we can just leave. Okay, is there a body part inside here that I missed? No, I don't see any body parts. That's good though. Hmm. Yes, yeah, someone's been trolling. I got you. We're gonna leave him as is. Bye, bartender. Let's leave. Have you found out anything yet? Well, madam, I spoke to Sherlock, but he's somewhat occupied right now. Typical. The conceited buffoon. However, I am able to inform you that I, Bertram Fiddle, am now on the case of Jeff the Murderer. And I shan't rest until I find him. Oh my goodness, this is wonderful news. Our readers will be delighted to hear about That's it. That's right. You can tell your oh, readers... Oh, I've got so bad allergies. Holy fear. crap. I can be quite sleuthful when I need to okay. be. Okay. Here's my news blimp now. I must be off, Mr. Fiddle, but I'm sure I shall see you again. Oh, you have an actual blimp. Good luck, Mr. Fiddle. Okay. What does this say? Your Majesty. Okay, it's just the Queen. Okay, let's go keep looking. Hemlock Street? This must be Lord Arthwipe's abode. Arthwipe. Okay, uh... Extra! Extra! Bertram Fiddle on the hunt for Jeff the Murderer! That's right. Let's go talk to Lord Arthwipe. There he is. Is that a head? Have you heard the news, Fiddle? There's been another murder right under our noses. They say he is the devil himself. This guy's oh, weird. He's staring at me. He's like, terrible, have you heard the news, Fiddle? Terrible. There's been terrible. another murder. You do not know the meaning of the word, Fiddle. Now I, on the other hand, I have done some truly terrible things in my time. Yeah, I'm, I can see the head behind your chair. I am so rich. I am above the law. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was enough laughing. Is that blood? Is that blood on your carpet? Yes, I I cut myself shaving. No, you didn't. Don't touch my saber. Okay. Let's uh see what this is. Interesting paintings, your lordship. Are they Dutch? Are they Dutch? Uh, nice doggy. It's not a dog, you fool. It's a wolf beast. Okay, I, I that was not any of my guesses. Okay, uh, we don't need to go up there just yet. What's in here? Oh, that's an interesting collection of etchings. Okay, can we not touch the skull? Oh, we can do the drink. Let's see what the drink is. Tiger cordial fiddle. A most refreshing libation. Do you want some? It puts a spring in your step, fiddle. Makes you feel ten feet tall. I would like some, yes. Tiger, okay. It... Uh, did I get it? No, I did not. A little errand. You may encounter a Lady Ravishon whilst traipsing around. Okay. She has in her possession some photographs. That I would rather she did not. Okay, photographs. I need you to retrieve them for me. If you obtain them successfully, meet me in Lady Ravisham's secret garden, and I will reward you handsomely. Okay. But tell no one, Fiddle. No one. No one. Okay. I have arranged for my coat. When are you going to be stop talking? It is waiting outside. 
<laughs> um, okay. Thank you. My turn now. Ah, uh, Mr. Fiddle. I've been waiting for you. Okay, let's go. Uh, should we... Yeah, okay, let's go. Hurry up, I ain't got all day. Come on, Gavin. Dumb Cyclops. Did he help? Here we go. It's the end of chapter two. We're on chapter three. Further entanglings. What a peculiar day this is turning out to be. I'm never going to find myself an adventure at this rate. There is no way a man of my caliber should have to work for Mr. Dullsworth. There's not. But at least this mission for Lord Arthwhite should see us well rewarded. That is true. I don't trust him. He has funny eyes. Yes, he does. Lord Arthwhite? He's a very important and extremely well-connected gentleman. If we can impress him, I'm sure he will be able to provide us with some form of adventure. We must hunt down this Jeff the murderer and fast. But the odds are stacked against us. He has eluded all attempts at capture so far and taunts even the greatest detective minds. Imagine the look on Sherlock's face if we were to succeed where he has not. And your wife's dog, sir. And Foofy. Yeah, Foofy. I must get him back or Werther will be furious. Foofy. We have been saying in Peru, an armadillo never gives up. You're right, Gary. There he is. And neither sh <laughs> There he is now. Quick, stop the Foofy! Don't let him get away again, Gavin! Foofy! Are we doing another he chase? Is behind bars, where he belongs. Okay. Give me back my Foofy. Oh, damn it! How did he get through there? How okay, did uh... Do you do this? An oar? Next to a gate? In an alley? Okay. Why? You could say it was an alligator. But um, <laughs> awkward silence. Okay. Uh, this has to do something somewhere. No. Okay. Uh, we've got to be able to use this or for something. Is it for the window? No. Uh, let's see. What can we use the ore for? They won't budge. Okay, they won't budge. Uh, can we use it here? No. There's something up there leaking. Okay, nothing. Huh. Dr. Jupitron's reinvigorative tonic. A cure for all your ailments and whimsies. Okay. Uh huh. Hey, you got good here. Smallpox, bigpox, vox pal, cow fever, loss, pimples, the vapors, and give unbridled enthusiasm in matters of the heart. Okay. We have to figure out a way to get through this. Oh, he's super strong. That's right. He is super strong. Yes. See if he can do it. Quickly, Gavin, you come logically off. We must follow him. That took me too long to figure out. Okay. Come on, Gavin. Sir, I sense a disturbance in defense. <laughs> okay, let's go. He's a slippery little fellow. Yes, he is. Where's he gone now? Okay, uh, let's see. What did you say? Huh. What is it? I can click on these? Gracious me! Those are sizable undergarments. Yep. Yeah. Okay, let's talk to this guy. And then we're gonna look inside the house. Excuse me, did you see a man run by? About this high, mean, squinty eyes, a menacing scowl. Indeed I did. He knocked me over and trod on my monocle. 
Don't bother, it's cracked. It's no use to me now. Okay. Here, let me help you up. Let me take that. It's broken, but it might just help. Yeah, let me take that. Uh, let's go inside here. Count Fulchmuckle's residence. How may I help you? I am on the hunt for a fiendish villain who has the city in a grip of terror. May I come in? You can't come in. Master is out. Okay. He went out on one of his nocturnal perambulations last night, and I haven't seen him since. Oh, really? He's a funny one, to be honest, sir. Honest. He hates the lie, and he has some strange requests. But he's always been good to okay. me. Ah, I, I should probably be off now. Oh, yes. I'm afraid I've said too much. Good day, sir. And if you see the Count, tell him his breakfast is getting cold. Yeah, I would assume so. It's dark. Okay, now let's, uh, I guess we go back this way. Okay. This is Lady Ravisham's house. She was known as the most beautiful lady in London, but no one has seen her for years. Huh, okay. What about th That's too heavy for me. Yes. Go get it, Gavin. doing with it hmm it's a good start okay can I go this way oh I can oh what's down in here you now my feet are all wet okay you can we use this or yeah, or maybe not. Gotcha. Okay, uh, let's go down in here. What's in here? Okay. Mm. There's someone in here. I can hear them. A faint sliver of light. Okay, uh... Let's go down here and see what's down here. Can't see a thing. Okay, I need a lot. Okay, I need a lot to come back in there. So, okay, I wonder if I can use the monocle on that. Can I use the broken monocle on that? We need some illumination. Yeah, okay, so the monocle doesn't work. Can we do this? No, that won't mix. Okay, can we do it? This or nope. Okay. We don't have we don't have the rot equipment yet to go down in here. Yeah, okay. Woods grape water. So let's go up here. Uh, to Ready Lady Raps. Let's see what this is. These gangs of pigeons are getting bolder all the time. Shoo! Shoo! What are they picking at? I wonder what that is. It's a Mouth. One more piece of the puzzle. A mouth? That's not to be s What a winning smile. Ew. Okay, now we just need two eyes. That's still qu That's still quite high, Gavin. And I'm wearing my tight trousers. Okay. Uh, let's go inside Lady Ravishams. What is this? The lesser spotted glump. The lesser. Okay. Uh, do we go upstairs or how do we do this? Okay, I guess we go back down because we can't go across. This gaping. Okay, let's go back down. <laughs> let's go into here. I still need to find a lot. Hey, there she is. What a dreadful racket. I okay. Let's talk to her, see what she says. Hello, your ladyship. How are you? What's that? I can't hear a word you're saying. Okay, I know what to do. Oh, that's better. I can hear you now. 
Have you heard about the murderous villain known only as Jeff the Murderer? I, Bertram Fiddle, am hunting him down. Yes, I am. You should be careful. Living on your own. Don't worry, young man. I have a feeling I shall be quite safe. Is there anything else you want? Squawk! Have you met Mr. Calamus? He's my only companion. I tell him all my secrets. Okay. Tells me all her secrets, but never remembers to feed me. <laughs> really got the energy to lift my wings. Okay. I'm no telltale. My beak is sealed. What did you say? All he wants a cracker. I'm starving. Do I have anything I can feed him? Can we hit him with a... Oh. Okay, no. Okay, he wants something to eat. Let's see what's in here. What a magnificent diamond. diamond. Look how it catches the light. Oh. Uh, that thing. A mere trinket that has brought nothing but bad luck. A gift from someone I'd rather forget. Oh, can I have it? May it bring you better fortune than it has me. Okay, so that'll illuminate the alleyway. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna leave this episode here, guys. Sorry for uh, my sniffling and my rubbing and my itching. I, spring kills me. I've said that before in a vlog, and I'm saying it again. Spring kills me. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Please give me a like and subscribe if you did. I'm Paper Sad, guys, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!